Hi everybody, it's Mr. 36 Scooters, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to put a threadless headset on a, a threaded fork. Now, yeah, so let me get you all set up. Then we close this. Alright, so first things first, what you're going to need are obviously your deck for your headset cups. You need your headset cups. I already put mine in. Um, just to save some time, and you're going to need your bottom bearing and your top bearing. So yeah, so first off, you can put your top bearing in. Also, you're going to need your top cap and your lock nut and your third fork. So yeah, so yeah, you put your top bearing in, put your bottom bearing on, and the way you can determine whether it's a bottom bearing or not is that the bottom bearing should fit perfectly over your fork race and then your bottom one should fit, fit perfectly in the top cup and then yeah so also you want for the one on your fork you want the ball bearings to be facing up the flat part down and then the opposite on the top you want it the balls facing down and the flat part on top so yeah so slide that through then take your top cap um if you're lucky and have a Nico headset or any type of threadless headset where the I don't know if you guys can see but my um bearing race to hold my compression ring it's actually built in so yeah so we'll slide that on so once you have that on take your lock nut I don't know if you can see but the round part is on the top and that's what locks it in then yeah and I'm going to leave mine somewhat loose or I'll, actually I'll tighten it all the way just I because I'm going to make a video on how to make a scooter dial so you might need to hold your bearing up on, on the cup like me and yeah so just tighten it and it might seem really tight, but once you have your bars on, it'll add more weight. It's almost like compression, basically. Like threadless or threaded for compression is a lock nut. Threadless is obviously HIC, Proto, ICS, IHC, and that's it. We're not. I'm not gonna say Proto, but SCS. Now, see, mine is pretty tight. So just want to loosen it up a little bit. And when it, once it's spinning about halfway with no wobble, you're good. And then you put your bars on, and then obviously it'll spin a lot better. And then yeah, it'll be some. It should be pretty dialed. And yes, yeah, so bye.